Jean-Paul Belmondo, a French actor, left an indelible mark on the film industry with his versatile performances. Born on April 9, 1933, in neuilly sur seine France, Belmondo initially pursued a career in boxing before turning to acting. His breakthrough role came in 1960 with the French New Wave film Breathless, where he played a criminal on the run. The film's success propelled Belmondo to stardom and established him as a leading figure in French cinema. Throughout his career, Belmondo appeared in over 80 films, showcasing his talent in various genres, from comedy and drama to action and adventure. He was known for performing his own stunts, adding an extra layer of excitement to his performances. One of his most memorable roles was in the 1965 film Pierrot Le Faux, where he played a man who leaves his wife and child to run away with his ex-girlfriend. The film is considered a classic of French New Wave cinema and showcases Belmondo's ability to portray complex characters. Belmondo's talent was not limited to French cinema. He also achieved success in Hollywood, appearing in films such as The Professional and His Paris Burning. His performances were praised by critics and audiences alike, solidifying his status as a global star. Throughout his career, Belmondo received numerous accolades, including a César Award for Lifetime Achievement in 1989. He was also made a commander of the Legion of Honor, France's highest honor, in 2017. Despite his success, Belmondo remained humble and dedicated to his craft. He continued to act until his retirement in 2008, leaving behind a legacy of classic films and memorable performances. Belmondo's contributions to the film industry will continue to resonate with audiences for generations to come. Jean-Paul Belmondo was a renowned French actor, known for his distinctive style and charisma. Throughout his career, he worked in a variety of genres, from drama to action, and was often praised for his physicality and comedic timing. One aspect that sets Jean-Paul Belmondo apart from his contemporaries is his ability to perform his own stunts, which was quite unusual for actors in his era. This lent an authenticity to his performances and added an extra layer of excitement for audiences. A lesser known fact about Belmondo is that, before becoming an actor, he was a boxer. This background may have contributed to his physical prowess and tough guy image on screen. Do you have a favorite Jean-Paul Belmondo film or performance? Many fans cherish his role in Breathless, a groundbreaking French New Wave film. In this movie, Belmondo plays a charming criminal who becomes a symbol of youth rebellion. As we continue exploring the life and career of this classic star, prepare to discover many funny, shocking, and sad facts. We would love to hear your stories and memories related to Jean-Paul Belmondo in the comments below. Jean-Paul Belmondo was born in 1933 to Paul Belmondo, a renowned French sculptor, and Sarah Renaud Richard, a talented painter. His parents' artistic background greatly influenced his path towards the world of acting. As a child, Belmondo was exposed to various artistic circles and developed an appreciation for the arts. Belmondo's early years were marked by a love for sports, particularly boxing, which he pursued passionately. However, his destiny lay in a different direction. After completing his military service, he decided to study acting and enrolled at the National Academy of Dramatic Arts in Paris. During his time at the Academy, Belmondo came under the wing of the esteemed French actor and director Henri Roland. Roland recognized Belmondo's potential and became a key mentor, guiding him in his early acting career. Belmondo's raw talent and charisma quickly caught the attention of other industry professionals, leading to his big break in the film Breathless by John Luc Godard. This classic film not only launched Belmondo's career, but also solidified his status as a leading figure in the French New Wave cinema movement. The actor's magnetic presence and unique acting style left an indelible mark on the industry, inspiring a generation of actors and filmmakers. Belmondo's upbringing in an artistic family, his early exposure to the arts, and the mentorship of influential figures like Henri Roland all played pivotal roles in shaping his career as an actor. These experiences laid the groundwork for his enduring legacy in the world of cinema. Jean-Paul Belmondo, a French actor, left an indelible mark on the film industry during his era and beyond. His career, which spanned over five decades, was marked by his versatile acting style and charismatic screen presence. Belmondo gained international fame in the early 1960s with his role in Breathless, a French New Wave film that challenged traditional storytelling norms. His portrayal of a criminal on the run from the law was a departure from the leading men of the time and helped to usher in a new era of French cinema. The actor's influence extended beyond France, 
as he became a symbol of French cool and a household name in Hollywood. He starred in several high-profile films, including The Professional and Pierre Lefaux, which showcased his range as an actor and solidified his status as a leading man. Belmondo's contribution to Hollywood went beyond his on-screen performances. He was instrumental in bringing French cinema to a wider audience, paving the way for future collaborations between French and American filmmakers. His work also inspired a new generation of actors who sought to emulate his unique style and charisma. Despite his passing in 2021, Belmondo's impact on the film industry remains significant. His legacy continues to resonate with audiences and filmmakers alike, serving as a reminder of the power of cinema to captivate and inspire. The actor's classic films and memorable performances will undoubtedly continue to be cherished for generations to come. Jean-Paul Belmondo's passion for acting can be traced back to his childhood, where he was surrounded by art and creativity. His father, Paul Belmondo, was a well-known sculptor, and his mother, Sarah, was a painter. This artistic environment sparked his interest in the world of performing arts. As a young man, Belmondo was drawn to the stage and began his acting journey in the late 1940s. He honed his craft in various theatrical productions, developing his unique style and building a strong foundation in the industry. A pivotal moment in Belmondo's career came when he was cast in the 1956 film Moliere, where he played the role of a young actor. This experience allowed him to work alongside accomplished actors and directors, further fueling his desire to pursue a career in film. In the early 1960s, Belmondo gained recognition for his work in the French New Wave cinema movement. His performance in the 1960 film Breathless catapulted him to stardom and solidified his place as a leading man in French cinema. Throughout his career, Belmondo continued to push boundaries and explore different genres from action and comedy to drama and romance. His unwavering dedication to his craft and his ability to captivate audiences made him a beloved figure in the world of cinema. In summary, Jean-Paul Belmondo's passion for acting was ignited during his childhood and nurtured through his theatrical experiences. His breakthrough role in Breathless and his continuous exploration of various genres solidified his status as a legendary actor, leaving a lasting impact on the world of cinema. Jean-Paul Belmondo, beloved action star of Jackie Chan and Chow Yun-Fat, made headlines in Hollywood in April 1996 due to his frustration with the limited screen time given to his film Desired in France. With only 20 screens, compared to the 500 screens for American films like Toy Story, Belmondo expressed his discontent with French theater chains being on their knees before Hollywood. At the time, American films held 54% of the market share for movie ticket sales in France, while French-made products accounted for 35%. Married to a former Paris opera ballet dancer, Belmondo's career was marked by his unique action style and charisma. His impact on cinema extended beyond French borders, earning him admiration from renowned actors like Chan and Yun Fat. Despite the challenges faced by French cinema, Belmondo's influence remained significant, leaving a lasting impression on the industry and his fans. Born into a family of artists, Jean-Paul Belmondo, or the actor, faced financial struggles in his early life. His father, a well-known sculptor, couldn't provide consistent support for his passion for acting. To make ends meet, the actor took on various jobs, from working at a steel factory to selling mattresses. Despite these hardships, he never lost sight of his dream. As the film star rose to fame, he encountered skepticism from the industry. Critics questioned his rugged charm and unconventional looks, labeling him an anti-star. Instead of succumbing to pressure, the actor embraced his individuality and used it to his advantage. He defied expectations by excelling in both dramatic and comedic roles, solidifying his place as a versatile talent. During the 1960s, the actor faced another challenge when the French New Wave movement emerged, focusing on innovative storytelling techniques. Rather than being overshadowed, he adapted and thrived in this new landscape. By collaborating with influential directors like Jean-Luc Godard, the actor demonstrated his resilience and commitment to his craft. The actor's determination led him to create his own production company, which allowed him to have more control over his projects. This bold move enabled him to take on diverse roles and work with a variety of talented artists. By overcoming financial struggles, industry skepticism, and embracing change, Jean-Paul Belmondo left an indelible mark on the world of cinema. Jean-Paul Belmondo, the French actor, brought a unique charm to the screen with his distinctive style. In 1988, 
He delighted fans in the popular French show Les Guignols de l'Info, with a memorable appearance that showcased his playful charisma. Known for his charm, Belmondo lent his iconic presence to action-packed comic book characters like Cobra and Blueberry, solidifying his status as a symbol of French masculinity. The mention of his influence in Donovan's Sunny South Kensington song is a testament to his enduring appeal, where his image resonated beyond film and TV, capturing the imagination of listeners. This classic actor left an indelible mark on the world of entertainment. Jean-Paul Belmondo's career was marked by several breakthrough moments that showcased his versatility as an actor. In the early 1960s, he gained recognition for his role in A About the Souffle, a French New Wave film. The director, Jean-Luc Godard, was impressed by Belmondo's ability to blend charm and recklessness, which became a signature style in his later works. Later, in the 1970s, Belmondo transitioned from arthouse films to mainstream cinema. His performance in Le Professionnel was particularly noteworthy. The film's director, Georges Lautner, praised Belmondo's physical prowess and charisma, stating that he brought a unique energy to the set. In the 1980s, Belmondo returned to the stage, demonstrating his versatility as a theater actor. His performance in Keane was critically acclaimed, with one critic noting that Belmondo's charisma and stage presence were electrifying. Throughout his career, Jean-Paul Belmondo has been celebrated for his ability to captivate audiences with his charm, physicality, and versatility. His contributions to French cinema and theater have left an indelible mark, transcending generations and resonating with audiences worldwide. Jean-Paul Belmondo, known for his daring stunts, famously performed them himself until an accident during the filming of Hold Up in 1985. This incident marked a turning point in his career. The actor has left a lasting impression on those he worked with. Ursula Andress, his co-star in The Longest Day, even called him the love of her life. Such sentiments attest to his charisma and charm, both on and off screen. In 1995, Empire Magazine recognized Belmondo's appeal, ranking him number 52 on their list of the 100 sexiest stars in film history. This accolade speaks to his enduring appeal and the timeless quality of his performances. Despite the challenges he faced, Belmondo's legacy remains significant. His decision to perform his own stunts, his romantic connections, and his inclusion in Empire's list all contribute to the lasting impression he has made on the film industry and his fans. The actor's career is a testament to his talent and dedication, leaving behind a body of work that continues to inspire and captivate audiences. Jean-Paul Belmondo was a French actor known for his charismatic performances and physical prowess on screen. His artistic vision often revolved around portraying complex characters with depth and nuance. He approached his work with enthusiasm and dedication, often performing his own stunts and bringing a sense of realness to his roles. Belmondo's upbringing and life experiences greatly influenced his acting style. Growing up with parents who were both artists, he developed an appreciation for creativity and self-expression at an early age. This led him to pursue a career in acting where he could bring his unique perspective to life. The actor's worldview was also reflected in his choice of roles. He often played characters who challenged societal norms and pushed boundaries, reflecting his belief in individual freedom and expression. In addition, Belmondo had a deep connection to his roots and frequently incorporated elements of French culture into his performances. One notable aspect of Belmondo's style was his ability to balance humor and drama seamlessly. Whether playing a suave leading man or a quirky supporting character, he brought a light-hearted energy to every role while still maintaining emotional authenticity. Overall, Jean-Paul Belmondo's artistic vision and process were characterized by his commitment to creating dynamic and engaging performances that resonated with audiences worldwide. Through his diverse body of work, he left behind a legacy as one of France's most beloved actors. Jean-Paul Belmondo's refusal to accept his César award in 1988 showcased his loyalty and respect for his father, Paul Belmondo, who was also a sculptor. The sculptor of the César award, César Baldacini, had previously shared negative opinions about Paul Belmondo's work, which led to Jean-Paul's decision. The actor made his stage debut in 1950 and went on to become a prominent figure in French cinema. His career included numerous appearances in films, some of which featured the beer, a Cam Bridge in Paris, a location that has since been renamed in his honor. In March 2023, the city of Paris decided to rename the promenade under the metro on Beer Hakim Bridge after Jean-Paul Belmondo. 
This location holds significance as it has been featured in many of his films, including Per sur la Ville, Last Tango in Paris, and Inception. The promenade now serves as a tribute to the actor's contributions to the film industry and his enduring legacy. Jean-Paul Belmondo, a French actor who dominated the cinema scene in the 1960s and 1970s, left an indelible mark on the industry. His charismatic performances and unique style brought a fresh perspective to French New Wave cinema. Belmondo's contribution to the industry cannot be overstated. He starred in over 80 films, many of which became classics of French cinema. His ability to switch between dramatic and comedic roles showcased his versatility and range as an actor. One of Belmondo's most notable contributions was his influence on the trends of French cinema. He popularized the tough guy image, often playing characters who were rugged, rebellious, and charming. This image became a staple in French cinema and inspired a generation of actors. Belmondo's techniques also had a significant impact on the industry. He was known for his physicality and willingness to perform his own stunts, which added a level of authenticity to his performances. His ability to convey emotion through subtle facial expressions and body language set him apart from his peers. Industry experts and those he inspired have praised Belmondo's contributions to the industry. Director John Luke Goddard, who worked with Belmondo on Breathless, said, he had a kind of naturalness, an ease, a grace that was very rare. Actor Jean Dujardin, who won an Oscar for his role in The Artist, cited Belmondo as an inspiration, saying, he was a model for me, a reference. Belmondo's influence extended beyond French cinema, inspiring filmmakers and actors around the world. His ability to captivate audiences with his charisma and talent has left a lasting impact on the industry, and his classic films continue to resonate with audiences today. In the end, Belmondo's contribution to the industry was not just about his talent or technique. It was about his ability to connect with audiences and inspire future generations of filmmakers and actors. His legacy will continue to live on in the industry he helped shape. Jean-Paul Belmondo is known for his romantic relationships as much as his acting career. From 1965 to 1972, he cohabited with Ursula Andress, a Swiss actress. Following his split with Andres, Belmondo moved on and started a new relationship with Italian actress Laura Antonelli, which lasted from 1972 to 1980. Later, in 1989, the actor began a relationship with Natty, also known as Nathalie Tartival. They were together for over a decade before tying the knot on December 29, 2002. However, their marriage was short-lived, and they eventually separated in 2008. Throughout his life, Jean-Paul Belmondo had a series of high-profile relationships with notable actresses, adding to his already impressive legacy in the film industry. Jean-Paul Belmondo, the accomplished actor, was known for bringing a unique energy to his roles, both on and off-screen. In his personal life, he had a great love for sports, particularly boxing and football. This passion for physicality often found its way into his films, where he performed many of his own stunts and action sequences. Belmondo was also a dedicated family man. He married three times and had four children. His family was a constant source of support and inspiration for him, and he often spoke of the importance they played in his life. The actor was also deeply committed to giving back to his community. He was involved in various philanthropic efforts throughout his career, often using his platform to raise awareness and funds for various causes. One such cause was the fight against AIDS, to which he contributed significantly. In addition to his love for sports and family, Belmondo had a deep appreciation for the arts. He was an avid collector of paintings and sculptures, and his personal art collection was said to be quite extensive. This love for art often influenced his film choices, as he was drawn to roles that allowed him to explore different aspects of human emotion and experience. Despite his many personal interests and commitments, Belmondo remained dedicated to his craft throughout his career. He approached each role with a sense of passion and commitment, always striving to bring something new and unique to the screen. His personal values and interests informed his work, making him a truly captivating and enduring presence in the world of cinema. Jean-Paul Belmondo, a well-known actor and brother to Alain, and Muriel Belmondo experienced a significant health setback while in Corsica in 2001. He suffered a stroke that left the right side of his face paralyzed. The actor was promptly transferred to a Paris hospital and released from intensive care after six days. Prior to this incident, Belmondo had been in a relationship with Maria Carlos Sotomayor, which lasted from 1980 to 1987. 
The couple's time together was marked by a deep connection and mutual support. Despite the challenges he faced, Jean-Paul Belmondo's career as an actor remained a source of pride and accomplishment. His contributions to the world of film continue to be celebrated and appreciated by audiences of all ages. The actor's legacy is a testament to his talent, hard work, and dedication to his craft. Jean-Paul Belmondo, a legendary French actor, left an indelible mark on the film industry. His dynamic performances in both dramatic and comedic roles showcased his remarkable range and versatility. Belmondo's charismatic screen presence captivated audiences and inspired aspiring actors for generations. Throughout his illustrious career, Belmondo starred in numerous classics, including Breathless and Pierre Le Fou. These films, along with many others, not only resonate with moviegoers, but also serve as a testament to the actor's enduring talent. For those aspiring to follow in Belmondo's footsteps, he once offered the following advice always be yourself, and never stop learning and growing as an artist. He emphasized the importance of staying true to one's values and constantly honing one's craft. Belmondo's legacy extends beyond his own contributions to the film industry. He paved the way for future generations of actors to push boundaries and explore new depths in their performances. The actor's impact transcended the realm of cinema, leaving a lasting impression on the world of entertainment. As aspiring professionals embark on their own journeys in the industry, they can look to Belmondo's career as a source of inspiration and guidance. By staying true to themselves and continuously learning, they too can leave a lasting legacy in their chosen field. Jean-Paul Belmondo had a passion for sports in his younger years, particularly enjoying boxing and soccer. He even served as a goalkeeper during his time in school. Later in life, he brought this athleticism to his roles, including portraying a French foreign legionnaire in Casino Royale. In one scene, he playfully references his character from That Man from Rio by hiding an apparent hand injury, a nod to his earlier film. Belondotto also became connected to his fellow actors off-screen. For instance, he can claim connection through marriage to Luana Belmondo, who is his daughter-in-law. These personal details offer insight into the actor's life beyond his iconic performances. Born in 1933, Jean-Paul Belmondo, a French actor, quickly became known for his passionate performances and innovative style. He began his career in the late 1950s, appearing in various films and plays. However, it was his role in Breathless that catapulted him to stardom, solidifying his status as a leading figure in the French New Wave movement. Throughout his career, the actor demonstrated a remarkable ability to adapt to different genres and roles. From action hero to romantic lead, he captivated audiences with his charismatic presence and undeniable talent. His willingness to take risks and push boundaries contributed significantly to the evolution of modern cinema. One notable aspect of Belmondo's work is his commitment to physicality. In many of his films, he performed death-defying stunts and daring feats, further engaging viewers and setting himself apart from his peers. This dedication to his craft left an indelible mark on the entertainment industry inspiring future generations of actors and filmmakers alike. Despite facing personal and professional challenges, the actor remained steadfast in his pursuit of excellence. Over six decades, he starred in more than 80 films, earning critical acclaim and numerous awards along the way. Even in his later years, he continued to act, proving that age could not diminish his enthusiasm or artistic vision. The legacy of Jean-Paul Belmondo serves as a testament to the power of creativity and perseverance. Through his groundbreaking work, he has forever changed the landscape of cinema, leaving behind a rich tapestry of unforgettable performances. As we reflect on his extraordinary journey, let us remember that with determination and imagination, we too can make our mark on the world. Let's take a moment to appreciate the remarkable career of Jean-Paul Belmondo. The actor, known for his charm and versatility, left an indelible mark on French cinema. His work spanned across various genres, from crime dramas like Breathless to action-packed films such as Le Professionnel. Throughout his career, Belmondo never shied away from taking on challenging roles. He brought depth and authenticity to each character he played, making them truly memorable. His performances were not just acting, but a celebration of life, passion, and humor. This classic actor's legacy extends beyond his filmography. He was a symbol of French culture and an inspiration to many aspiring actors. His ability to captivate audiences with his energy and charisma is something that resonates through the annals of cinema history. Now, we'd love to hear your thoughts on Jean-Paul Belmondo's work and legacy. 
What are your favorite films or performances of his? How has his career influenced your perspective on French cinema? Share your memories and opinions in the comments below. Don't forget to like, share, and subscribe for more content celebrating the creative spirits shaping entertainment. Let's keep the conversation going and cherish the contributions of this iconic film.